Our homes are our castle. Our castle. We must defend the castle from bugs, from deer, from the rain, and yes, from the heat. Be the swamp cooler. Let's fire it up. Fire it up. Fire it up. Bum, bum, bum. Alright, Joseph, you want to carry this? Sure. Alright. What's this? That is paint for the swamp cooler. And this is... I, I, well, that little step is on. Step number one for firing up your swamp cooler. Take off the covers. Unfortunately, our cover shredded through the winter, so we got to get new covers next uh, fall. But anyway, take off the covers. So a uh, slightly unfortunate situation has arisen. Basically, <laughs> I was transitioning and I did not realize that the coating that you put on the pan of the swamp cooler has to set for eight to 24 hours, eight to 24 hours, which means you cannot put water in it. And it's pretty hot today. So <laughs> defending the castle from the heat today is maybe not gonna happen completely today. So. I will finish in the next couple days, come back for a complete tutorial. I'll actually jump to this footage from today in a couple days to complete the tutorial on how to fire up your swamp cooler. Ah. <laughs> Welcome back, fast forward. What did we do, 15 hours ago maybe? That we uh, put this stuff in the bottom here of the swamp cooler pan. We should be good to go now. Basically I've had some leak issues in the past, but uh, no more. We're gonna, we're gonna defeat the leaks. Give me if I've lost, lost count. All right, step nine, put the new uh, pads. Actually, one sec. Put the new pads into the panels, and um, it's not too hard to do. You, you'll figure it out. You basically just kind of tuck it in, and always buy a pad, uh, never too small, always a little bigger than what you might need, because then you can just tuck it in, no problem. All right, here we go. Panels are ready. All right. I'm gonna stop saying the steps because I can't remember the numbers I'm on. And if you're wondering what the music is behind this uh, little sequence here, we are listening to a remix of The Grateful Dead. That's right, I went to a, a Dead & Company concert a couple days ago with my mom. She's a Deadhead fan. So anyway, uh, next step, oil. You wanna put a little bit of oil in the uh, wheel that spins the motor uh, just to keep it moving, nice and moving. We are getting close, folks. Next step, the pump. Got to plug the pump in to the bracket up here. If you have this style right up there. And then I always put the, the basket sitting right here. And that is what uh, will prevent the uh, pump from basically clogging. So let me show you. Alright, now, you want to make sure your bobber's in place and also this plug so that the water doesn't drain out of your swamp cooler once uh, water starts flowing up through the little pipe. So that's what we're doing now.
And I'm back. Okay, so this uh, little plug I invented to help keep the heat in the house during the winter, but I gotta take it out now. It's really messy, but it's worth it. Keeps your energy oh. bills a little lower. All right, here we go. That is all from the winter, just like dust getting blown into the swamp cooler down through the chute, even though you have covers on all winter, still. So that actually prevents a lot of dust from getting in your house too. Bonus Jonas. Oh, we are now under the house, getting real close now. Gotta find, I don't know where yours is at, maybe it's in your garage, I'm down in my crawl space. So, gotta find the place to turn the water on that feeds the water up to the swamp cooler. Uh, but then, you gotta go up as quick as possible back to the roof and make sure the bobber is working okay, well so that it. it turns off so that it it's doesn't overflow. Um, we're close, folks, let's get her done. down to your beautiful wife tell her to fire it up fire it up let's get her going and then we're gonna put the nails on that's the last almost the last step we're in business we're in business all right Whoa. a little bit of a scare there the pump was not working this guy but we got it. All right, now you put your panels on. Let's do it. See you for it. Here she goes. One last trick coming right up. Days, like today, it's 94 degrees in Denver. You want a little trick I have, get ice, put it in the swamp cooler pan, and it'll just cool the water down even more that trickles down through these pads. And basically it, the air is gonna be cooled even more being sucked through this uh, these uh, pads here. Eh, let's do it. <laughs> Thank you.